flew into Munich, and then we, uh, uh, from there, had to do a kind of short commuter flight to Leipzig. I was impressed by how the place was, uh, was clean com compared to other places in Europe and stuff like that. I actually think it would have been pretty cool if we'd flown into Berlin and then maybe taken like a train to Leipzig, because then we would have actually seen some of the German countryside. The place looks cool, was cool, and the beer was cool. The place was just filling with people, it was packed all the time. And uh, the public demos, I mean, they were crazy. Public ones, we, we, you know, we ended up doing, doing them every hour. There were a shitload of people, I mean, 250 people every hour. Public demo side of it was a super surprise because I hadn't realized just how uh, fanatic the German fans are for Far Cry as a brand, as a franchise. And sometimes we saw people just sitting on the floor waiting for the next presentation. Really, it ran the gamut from like little kids and families to teenagers to like like old couples. And, uh, I know LP was signing uh, signing uh, Xbox. I mean, I'm I'm no I'm not a rock star at all, but uh, I mean, we signed an autograph, we threw T-shirts. Uh, a guy wanted my T-shirt so bad. There were people who were literally paying to get back into the convention so that they could see the demo of Far Cry 2 again. And, and yeah, a lot of them wanted to come in and get like a Far Cry 2 t-shirt because we were giving those out. A guy really, really wanted my t-shirt. I gave my t-shirt once to a guy who actually wrote a comment on one of our blogs, but one guy really wanted my t-shirt, but I didn't have a t-shirt under it. So, but he was really insisting and uh, I really did insist on the fact that I was not going to walk bare-chested in the middle of a uh, of the expo, so uh, I turned him down, unfortunately. I think people ask questions about the game afterwards, which is kind of cool. And there was one guy came to me and, and straight asked, I want to talk about AI. It took like 20 minutes to explain everything, or maybe, you know, 15. And, and the guy was not reacting, so he was not saying anything. I was like, is that cool or is that not cool? Does he like or does he don't like? I was not sure. But when I finished, the guy was like, this is amazing. And then he laughed like that. Basically, the journalist, the German journalist for uh, for uh, the online journalist, the online media that voted for, for the award, and we won best new game. Really sweet, actually. I have to admit, when I went on the stage, I didn't I didn't understand anything because it was all in German. Und der Gewinner ist. Ich mache eine rhetorische Pause, damit unsere Video Jungs sich darauf vorbereiten können. Jetzt kommt das Gewinner Video. Far Cry 2! Ein Riesenapplaus! Far Cry 2, Gewinner! Kategorie Beste Neuvorstellung! Okay. Alright. This is LP, he's the producer of this game, Far Cry 2, and he's gonna say a few words to you before he leaves. It's gonna be in English. Yes, first of all, thank you everyone. Uh, we're, we're super happy to come here to uh, first time demo the game to the public. So it was uh, exciting for us. We worked really hard for it, so I want to thank the team first. The second of all, I want to thank to all the media that voted for us. But again, I want to thank the fans, you guys, for coming to see the game. And I know you'll love it when it comes out in spring 2008. Thank you. And I got a shaved head now because I lost a bet. The bet was uh, if uh, we won a prize over there, I had to shave my head. And uh, we did. We won Best New Game. And uh, so I did. It was a great opportunity to, to bring back uh, uh, this 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 great piece uh, to the team and to, you know to show that the people are appreciating what we're making and uh, I think the, the team uh, really uh, really took it uh, you know personally and with great pride that uh, you know first time we go public first time we show and you know we win something so that that means something to us.